know, uh, let's go. And I know, yeah. And I know, it's your clock. Yeah, I know, yeah, I know, and I know. I'm not the brightest out And yeah, you worry, but I ain't stopping now We came from the bottom, and now we climbing out And when they find us out, they gon' wanna sign us out And I know, it's crazy how everything happened I bet you never thought you'd see this lad nigga rapping Pop want a doctor, mama want a lawyer But far from Uncle Tom, I stayed in trouble like a sawyer Hey, no monotony, think logically Dreams they follow me everywhere that I go. All right, your swear we down here at the scenic lake, Yola. We got the homie Joe Clark right here, locomotive Joe in the building. You know what I'm saying? Tell him what's good, Joey. How, how you feeling today? I mean, it's good, man. I, I wasn't expecting this uh, so much of a crowd. I mean, it's good to be out here, man. I appreciate yeah. the opportunity. Yeah, that's what's up. We really brought Joe down here. You know we keep it exclusive. We're only interviewing cats that's really, you know, coming up in the game. And Joe's new in the game, but he's killing him. He's got the We Are The Stars mixtape out right now. And tell him a little bit about the tape, Joe. Um, it's 12 cuts. I did it uh, in conjunction with uh, www.buckmarleytxx.com. DJ Shout out Buck Marley. Yeah, man. Um, it's pretty much, it's not, I wouldn't want to say it's an album. It's not a mixtape. It's like a project. It's almost like a street album. When I listen to it, it's got that feel of like, it's not throwaway tracks. You just, you, you went in on everything. It's I almost got the feel of an album. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Talk about how, who's producing on there. It's like a lot of good production on there. Hold on joint. Yeah, man, fire. The, you know, the name of the project called We Are The Stars. And I put it that way because I wanted to make sure that I incorporated, you know, the I came So a lot of the production is actually local artists. Oh, okay. Shouts to Soy Sauce, out here in Orlando. A couple of my friends from up in Gainesville, C4 Bomb Squad, WizKids out here in Orlando okay. on the west side. So, you know, okay. it's definitely like a, it's a homegrown project. Okay, definitely. So talk a little bit about what steps out on the project to me is um, you mix a lot of conscience with, with swag, right? you know what I mean? So you're giving them you're giving them that knowledge, but at the same time you're giving them that style, Definitely. give them that swag, that style. Check out my man's SBs. You see Joe's killing them today. That I told her. But um, you give them that you give them that style mixing with the consciousness. So talk a little bit about why that's important. You know why it's important that, to um, both sides, the, the, the dichotomy. It's it's definitely necessary. Like it really it, it has to do with I guess my upbringing. I guess and I'm from all over the place. I was born in Boston. I grew up in okay. New York, and you know spent a lot of time down here in Florida. So mixing that is just I just do what comes natural to me. Put it right, that way. Right. I'm not no dude from out the street. Right. I just I try to represent as much as I can while still staying true to myself. So. Okay. As far as that swag, I get that from back home. Man. Okay, you know, <laughs> back home, but, uh, yeah. You know, I feel that. I, you definitely got to keep it conscious today just because I feel like in general, like everything's kind of coming back to lyrics nowadays. Hip hop is all right, about right. trends, and it's coming right back around to the type of music that I specialize in. So check you know, those lyrics on that. We are the stars. Check the lyrics. That's what the most important about it. The important part about it is and that's why we got Joe down here. Um, so yeah, with the lyricism coming back, um, what are some of your, your favorite artists right now? That's, oh, that's, that's out right now. Right this, now? Or who, who would you want to work time. with? Who would you want to work with right now? I would this, definitely. This kind of curiosity. I would definitely want to work with uh with like a Lupe as far as hip hop. Right, right, right. Lupe or Wale. Right. But Wale, shout out. They get that attention deficit, man. Yeah. That thing is amazing. That's, amazing. that's getting amazing. heavy burn out here. But I mean, just in general, I like I love all kinds of music. Right. You know? right. From you know, from your Lupe's to Kings of Leon, Kings of Leon you know, right, right. I would really want to work with people outside of the town. Okay, kind of just you know, push the bounds of the music. Okay, yeah, Joe. Um, other thing we we, we want to we to speak on a little bit is um, what are, what are some of the local Orlando artists that um, that you know that need some notoriety or who else? Who else is really out here that you think is really? Let's say on your level, because personally, you know, I haven't, I haven't seen many as good as you in Orlando, and that's just it's, just coming from a fan. I guess what it comes down to is it's all about, uh, I guess, preference. I kind of feel like there's not very many rappers that are like me in Orlando. You know, they're kind of more on, uh, I guess, more gangster tip or right, more right. underground battle rapper scene. But uh, definitely, shouts out to Jay Cruz. He's definitely, you know, if you like what I'm making, you definitely like me. Okay. Okay. All right. I'll definitely feel that. Um. So you know, I do this to everybody, man. If you see, um, matter of fact, the last interview I did was Freeway, man. Free spit 16 for us, man. So 
I got you. 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 I Hit any rebel to peep my wings. Still, it ain't close enough to clip my toe. I'm from the south, yeah, so I know. Hitters move weight, all in up my coats. Hit we make flip like the ice cream stove to that white cut low, like Amber Rose. I play the back of the back with a slow key go. Getting that dope. Sometimes I gotta go remind these hoes. You still fucking with that slow motion, Joe. You niggas still get that slow motion, though. I get it faster than heart attacks an overdose. I'm still up in the belly where the ulcer grow. Behind you, the opposite of ocean flow. I know. You've been waiting on a nigga so long, but this that song, the city of the old been open for. Shit, all these kids been hoping for. How you get it popping like that's a rack? Old mm -hmm. niggas popping like Kosovo. Mm -hmm. Black sites, they be your pack and stand. I'm General <laughs> Joe kicking that overthrow. Okay. <laughs> Yo, give some shout outs, man. Who you with a shout out, though? Shout out to BuckMarleyXXX.com. Shout out to the Army. Shout out to DJ96. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to the pack. Shout out to Orlando, man. Everybody putting it down out here. I appreciate it.